Hey guys, it's Luke bringing you your dude here, and I am back with more Dragon Age Inquisition. Ooh, I get more XP from reading these. Well, oh, hang on. <laughs> I must read all the things. All of them. It's only taking me a minute. <laughs> they wished to return to Haven. Someone will need to inform them if we are delayed. As you say, my lady. Okay, whatever. Uh... Alright, cool. Now let's go. <laughs> right here. Ooh. A really nice uh, city. Uh. You know what? I changed my mind. I will read these. <laughs> Wait, what? Hang on. Uh, here we go. No, I want, I want my codex. Um, where could it be? <laughs> Only they had organized that a bit more. Stand oh well. Good people of Val Royo, hear me. Together, we mourn our divine. A naive and beautiful heart silenced by treachery. You wonder what will become of a murderer. Well, wonder no more. Behold, the so-called Herald of Andraste, claiming to rise where our beloved fell. We say this is a false prophet. The Maker would say no elf in our hour of need. That's racist. <laughs> But we have a real enemy, okay? It's, it's the blight. You say I am the enemy. The breach in the sky is our true enemy. We must unite to stop it. It's true. The Inquisition seeks only to end this madness before it is too late. It is already too late. Oh, the Templars have returned to the Chantry. They will face this Inquisition, and the people will be safe once more. What? Still yourself. She is beneath us. What? Why would you do that? What's the meaning of this? Her claim to authority is an insult, much like your own. Lord Seeker Lucius, it's imperative that we speak with... You will not address me. I don't like Brigham. Lord Seeker. He's a dick. Creating a heretical movement, raising up a puppet as Andraste's prophet, you should be ashamed. Well, I didn't You should do it. all be ashamed. The Templars failed no one when they left the Chantry to purge the mages. You are the ones who have failed. You who'd leash our righteous swords with doubt and fear. If you came to appeal to the Chantry, you are too late. The only destiny here that demands respect is mine. Then help us close the breach. What we truly need is an alliance that will seal the breach. Though the breach is indeed a threat, but you certainly have no power to do anything about it. But Lord Seeker, 
What if he really was sent by the Maker? What if... You are called to a higher purpose. Do not question. I will make the Templar Order a power that stands alone against the Void. We deserve recognition. You know what all you Templars are dick. <laughs> you have shown me nothing. And the Inquisition, less than nothing. Templars, Val Royo is unworthy of our protection. We march. Charming fellow, isn't he? <laughs> Has Lord hey. Vicar Lucius gone mad? How old do you know him? Do you know him very well? He took over the Seekers of Truth two years ago, after Lord Seeker Lambert's death. He was always a decent man, never given to ambition and grandstanding. This is very bizarre. Well, you see reason, though. Do you think he can be reasoned with? I hope so. If not him, there are surely others in the Order who don't feel as he does. Either way, we should first return to Haven and inform the others. Yes. Probably should. <sighs> Alright, then. What's that? An arrow with a message? What? Favors for... Favors for... Not really much right. I believe that mess You are the Herald of Andraste, are you not? I have an invitation for you. Oh really? Ooh. Nice. I'll have to uh, investigate that later. Um for now. <laughs> Now, let's go back here. If I might have a moment of your time. Grand Enchanter Fiona? Leader of the Mage Rebellion. Is it not dangerous for you to be here? I heard of this gathering. And I wanted to see the fabled Herald of Andraste with my own eyes. If it's help with the breach you seek, perhaps you should look among your fellow mages. You weren't at the Conclave? I'm surprised the leader of the mages wasn't at the Conclave. Yes. You were supposed to be, and yet somehow you avoided death. As did the Lord Seeker, you'll note. Both of us sent negotiators in our stead, in case it was a trap. I won't pretend I'm not glad to live. I lost many dear friends that day. It disgusts hmm. me to think the Templars will get away with it. I'm hoping you won't let them. Think the Templars did it? So you think the Templars are responsible? Why wouldn't she? Lucius hardly seems broken up over his losses, if he's concerned about them at all. You heard him. You think he wouldn't happily kill the Divine to turn people against us? So yes, I think he did it. More than I think you did it, at any rate. Okay. Um... Will you help us, then? Does that mean the mages will help us? We are willing to discuss it with the Inquisition, at least. Consider this an invitation to Redcliffe. Come, meet with the mages. An alliance could help us both, after all. I hope to see you there. Au revoir, my Lord Herald. Yes. Come, let us return to Haven. Hmm, interesting. Well then.
you dislike the Templar system? No. <laughs> it's good you've returned. We heard of your encounter. You heard? My agents in a city sent word ahead, of course. It's a shame the Templars have abandoned their senses, as well as the capital. Yes, it is a shame. Um... But it was worth the risk. We had to do something, and now we have an opportunity. Yes, and we have the opening we need to approach the Templars and the Mages. Do we? Lord Seeker Lucius is not the man I remember. True, he has taken the order somewhere. But to do what? My reports have been very odd. We must look into it. I'm certain not everyone in the Order will support the Lord Seeker. Or the Herald could simply go to meet the Mages in Redcliffe instead. Could. You think the Mage Rebellion is more united? It could be ten times worse. Well, it's too soon. Or you could stop bickering and make a decision. I agree. We shouldn't discount Redcliffe. The Mages may be worth the risk. They are powerful, Ambassador, but more desperate than you realize. Hmm. They could be useful, you know. After the Divine's death, they're probably scrambling for allies. If some among the rebel mages were responsible for what happened at the Conclave, the same could be said about the Templars. True, True enough. Right now, I'm not certain we have enough influence to approach the Order safely. Then the Inquisition needs agents in more places. That's something you can help with. In the meantime, we should consider other options. Okay. There is one other matter. Several months ago, the Grey Wardens of Ferelden vanished. I sent word to those in Orlais, but they have also disappeared. Ordinarily, I wouldn't even consider the idea they're involved in all this, but the timing is curious. And who are Grey Wardens? Grey Wardens? I'm not familiar with them. They're an ancient order that has existed to fight Darkspawn invasions oh, since course. the First yeah. Light thousands of years ago. They have faded they since in, those um, glory days, but haven't disappeared entirely. Ordinarily, their order is neutral in political affairs, but... They appear in strange places. Why tell me? So you're telling me this because... The others have disregarded my suspicion, but I cannot ignore it. Two days ago, my agents in the Hinterlands heard news of a Grey Warden by the name of Blackwall. If you have the opportunity, Sounds please familiar. seek him out. Perhaps he can put my mind at ease. And if he can't? Then there may be more going on than we thought. See. Oh, okay. there. Excellent. Alrighty then. Uh, I think I can get. I can. Excellent. Question is, what do I want? That would be nice. Um. Hmm. Let's see. Let's do. Uh. This one. Okay. Cool. Nice. I do not know, that is, um, probably gonna do it for this episode. Uh, what do you have to say for yourself? You, you gotta, you Excuse gotta me. Talk. I've got a message Thank for the Inquisition, you. but I'm having a hard time getting anyone to talk to me. Give me the message. What's the message? We've got word of some Divinja mercenaries gathering out on the Storm Coast. 
My company commander, Iron Bull, offers the information free of charge. Oh, really? If you'd like to see what the Bull's charges can do for the Inquisition, meet us there and watch us work. Uh, tell me about your company. What can your Bull's charges offer the Inquisition? We're loyal, we're tough, and we don't break contracts. Ask around Val Royale. We've got references. Okay. Uh... Tell me about... What should I know about your commander? Iron Bull. Iron Bull? He's one of those Canari, the big guys with the horns. Okay. He leads from the front. He pays well, and he's a lot smarter than the last bastard I worked for. Best of all, he's professional. We accept contracts with whoever makes the first real offer. You're the first time he's gone out of his way to pick a side. Why give us this message? Why did your commander send us this information? Iron Bull wants to work for the Inquisition. He thinks you're doing good work. Okay, well, you're welcome to help. I look forward to meeting this Iron Bull. We're the best you'll find. Come to the Storm Coast and you can see us in action. Alright then. Interesting. Um, yeah, so that is probably going to do it for I did not see so. a good temple. No, uh, you guys watching, make sure you leave a like and a comment, and if you want to see more videos from me, hit the subscribe button, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!